this problem is for black to connect. So it seems a little far, right? But there are obvious weaknesses in white's pattern because there are so many bump moves that black can make, right? Threatening to cut because white is all diagonal like this. So one thought, of course, is that black plays here first and then plays this bump. And this will become a co, right? This will become a co. So that's the least black can do. But black can do more. Actually, just by switching the first and the third moves, right? By playing here, actually, black can succeed very easily. If white captures this stone, then black will be able to cut off white and kill white this way. So this is not acceptable for white. So white cannot play number two. If white connects, then now black plays here again, threatening to cut white off. And white can only connect here. And black will be able to connect here on the first line, like this. Now what about white playing this Atari? This is a good move to kind of seal off the first line. So black cannot connect via the first line. What should black do? Black will connect. White needs to connect. And now these two other diagonal moves, weaknesses, will be exposed. So all black needs to do is to play this bump and this bump again. Now, white is very short on liberties, only two left, and it really cannot capture these three black stones, right? If white connects here, then black ataris, these five stones will be dead. Similarly, if white connects here, black will be able to capture even more white stones. This will actually not work for white. So once again, it's all about trying these different bumps. I thought about these first as well. They won't work, but playing here will work. So it's about trying these bumps and try to exploit white's weaknesses as much as you can. Thank you for watching.